Man, have you checked out this wanted app? Everyone's getting into the crowdsource gig economy these days, even hired killers. Looking good. You talked to Sylvia from Atcha yet? She's a riot. When she says guerrilla marketing, she means it. Oh, yes. This is the life. Hey. This is seriously one of my favorite parts of town. If I could put someone on the Wanted app, who would it be? Nah. If I wanted to kill someone that much, I'd probably just do it myself. Oh, I could murder like five tacos right now. Hey, I've been thinking. Now that the Saints are a real organization, I feel like I should have a better understanding of, you know, all the basic skills involved in day-to-day -day operations. Uh, which means? I was hoping you could teach me to shoot. Oh, yeah, sure. Meet me at the old quarry. I set us up a kick-ass practice range. I could really get behind electric cars if they only had a clutch.
Hey. Wow. Eli, you set this range up yourself? Yep. I didn't have any clay pigeons, so I had to make do with what I could find. Nice. What weapons are you going to use? Oh, I'm more of a book learner. I've done some research already. I just wanted to watch you, ask questions, and take notes. That's not really how you learn to shoot. Hey, everybody learns differently. Now, the first thing I saw in my research was that stance is very important. Sure. You gotta have a stance. So what's a good stance? I mean, this? I can't describe it, I, I just gotta do it. Watch. Damn! Yeah, I get it. Next, my research said, keep your eyes open when you shoot? Sure. I like to pretend there's a little white dot or crosshairs on whatever I'm shooting at and then just aim for it. Like this. Damn! Yeah, I get it. What about breath control? I read a lot about exhaling when you pull the trigger. Honest to God, Eli, in a big firefight, I pay no attention to how I'm breathing. I just, well, look. Oh, and my research said to squeeze the trigger instead of pulling it? What the fuck's the difference? There's just a feel to it. Look. See a certain squeeze quality. Nice. Hey, what's up with those trucks? Looks like Marshall. Uh. We're probably near one of their black ops sites. Trespassers on Marshall land will be shot. Grab a gun. Hey, hey, I got one. Good job, man. See what I mean about the dot thing? Yeah. I'm good. one ah! this is what we call a target rich environment oh! Oof. Yeah! more trucks coming let's take them ah, this may be a bit much for a beginner get in the car Truck's coming. Let's take them. Uh, this may be a bit much for a beginner. Get in the car. Use 
You try. I'll do the covering fire from the uh, roof thing. Wait, that's not. Oh boy. How do you aim like this? Get back here and face the music. I'm gonna puke. Yeah, you better run. Yeah, <laughs> you're fair game now. You have. Ah! Don't let them escape. Whoa, 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 whoa! Should have got the roof rack. Oh my God, there's so many of them. Breathing. Ah! What am I doing? Okay, okay, okay. Okay, that was maybe a bit more hands-on learning than I was hoping for. Hey, no. You did great out there. I guess next time I'm in a tight spot like that idols party, I can slow him down. But I think I'll leave the car roof shit to you from now on. This place has so much potential. I can't wait to decorate. I've got a list of stuff that'll really complete the vibe, you know? We don't exactly have the budget for home decor right now. No problem. There's a nice cheap way. Come with me to Fort Cullen and I'll show you. There's a bunch of cool collectibles around town that would look amazing in the church. All we have to do is find a thing we want, snap a picture, and boom. It'll just show up there. Really? How does that work? It works. Yeah, but how? It just works. Don't overthink it. Do you know someone with like a 3D printer or something? I do actually. Remember Teddy? Your ex? The guy with the ponytail? Other ex Teddy. The woman with the mohawk? Right, so here's how it works. I think the Western Golden Cannon would rock at the church. Just take a picture of it. All right, let's head back and see what we got. So, Teddy, she was cool. She still is. I was thinking maybe next time we do a karaoke night, I'll invite her. Unless she's back with Melissa, of course. Ugh, Melissa. She has a good heart. No fucking way! This is not how I planned today going! How about we put the cannon here? Oh, 
Nice. That looks badass. Keep a lookout for the rest of the shit on that list, huh? This place has so much potential. Hey, you busy? I need your help with something. It's really important. I'm here. What's up? We need to get over to FB's ASAP. They're re-releasing the Mecha Burger. The what? The toy. Don't you remember? It looks like a hamburger, but turns into a robot. Limited edition re-release. Let's go. I think I had a Mecca Burger way back when. Everybody had one the summer I was nine. It was the most popular kids' meal toy FB's ever produced. And you want to relive your childhood? Sure. No problem. Oh, shit. Do you think they're all here for the Mecca Burger? Doesn't matter if they are. We can just muscle up to the head of the line. Welcome to FB's. Can I take your order? Uh, yes. Hi. May I please have a chicken brat box meal with a Mecha Burger toy? In purple, if you have it. We're out of Mecha Burgers. Shit. Well, there's another FB's in Marina del Lago. Let's try there. The Marina's FBs is also out. The next closest is a Mercado. And there are two in the flats, but we should try Mercado first. Dude, why is it so important to get a new one of these? Oh, I didn't have an old one. I never got one when I was a kid. It came out when I was in foster care. So. Oh, right. Let's get you a fucking Mecha Burger. What the hell are the idols doing here? Being pretentious anarchists and getting in everybody's way. What else? Well, they're between me and my kid's toy, so let's fix that. Bullets. 
the last of them. Let's get my mega burger. Hey, my friend here needs a chicken kids meal with a mecha burger toy in purple. They're all gone. Those horrible people in pink stole the entire shipment. They said something about striking a blow against capitalistic materialism and soggy french fries. Fucking idols. They really are a bunch of thugs taking joy from children. Fuck children. They took joy from you. Buckle up. There they are. Get them to pull over. Not sure whether to ram or shoot. Whatever. Just don't blow up the delivery car. Hey, my friend here needs a chicken kids meal with a mecha burger toy in purple. They're all gone. Those horrible people in pink stole the entire shipment. They said something about striking a blow against capitalistic materialism and soggy french fries. Fucking idols. They really are a bunch of thugs taking joy from children. Fuck children. They took joy from you. Buckle up. There they are. Get them to pull over. Not sure whether to ram or shoot. Whatever. Just don't blow up the delivery car. Take them down! So much easier when... Hey! My friend here needs a chicken kids meal with a mecha burger toy in purple. They're all gone. Those horrible people in pink stole the entire shipment. They said something about striking a blow against capitalistic materialism and soggy french fries. Fucking idols. They really are a bunch of thugs taking joy from children. Fuck children. They took joy from you. Buckle up. There they are. Get them to pull over. Not sure whether to ram or shoot. Whatever. Just don't blow up the delivery car. It's like a nightmare. Ooh. Pull the fuck over. much easier when I can use a rocket launcher. Happy with this? Hey! My friend here needs a chicken kids meal with a mecha burger toy in purple. They're all gone. Those horrible people in pink stole the entire shipment. They said something about striking a blow against capitalistic materialism and soggy french fries. Fucking idols. They really are a bunch of thugs taking joy from children. Fuck children. They took joy from you. Buckle up. There they are. Get them to pull over. Not sure whether to ram or shoot. Whatever. Just don't blow up the delivery car. So cool you're doing this for me. This is a ride share now. You are now the proud owner of 500 limited edition Mecha Burgers.
Nah, I just want one. And maybe sometime you could help me bring the rest down to the county orphanage? Absolutely. I wonder if I still have that old Santa Claus costume somewhere. Doesn't that costume have a shirt? Not when I wear it, baby. Hey, Eli. What's up? I hereby invite you to the inaugural meeting of the Saints Board of Directors. Oh. Uh, that sounds pretty corporate structure-y. It'll be donuts. On my way. Okay. So we got the name, we got the home base, we got the logo. So that means next step is to find people that can shoot guns? No. Uh, so that means next step is to make connections with the people that can shoot guns. Oh, come on, man. We want this thing to be more than a street gang. We want to be an organization, an institution. And that means we need to have our fingers in more pies. You got an idea where to start? As a matter of fact, I do. Okay. Everyone's action item is to reach out to their contacts and see what new business opportunities you can find for the Saints. Shit, my contacts all have their own things going already. What about JR? Your partner's on his garage, right? Maybe he'll go all in with the Saints? Couldn't hurt to ask. Great. What about you, Nina? I can't talk to any of my old Panteros contacts. But I do know some people who did business with them. I'm sure I can persuade them to do business with us instead. Nice. Kevin, <laughs> you want contacts? I got contacts, baby. Okay, go be superstars. Meantime, I'm gonna finish going through that briefcase we got from John Bland. That thing's a treasure trove, let me tell you. Everyone, keep me posted on your progress. JR, how'd you like to be part of something big? My friends and I are starting a new venture. Sounds awful nice, but our current venture's in trouble. Those Panteros are cutting into our profits something fierce. I'll tell you what, join our new thing, and no one's ever gonna mess with this garage again. Well, you take care of this Panteros problem and I'll consider it. Deal. Panteros fucking with our business. 
You name it. Undercutting costs, scaring off our customers. Sergio sent this jacked up mountain of a dude named Derek to run me out of business any way and every way he can. You take care of his toughs at the park, maybe you'll scare him enough to go mess with someone else. Say no more. I forgot leg day yesterday. Jim Rob's garage is off limits. Show your face there again, you're dead. The old man sent you? You mess with us. The saints protect what is ours. JR, I took care of the crew in the park. Well, I'll be. Let's go after their supply lines next. Derek's got a crew at the train depot smuggling in crates of stolen parts. That's how they keep undercutting my prices. Don't worry. I've got this. Feel free to blow up their cars, too. Panteros get real bugged by that. Hey, Eli. I'm cleaning up a Pantero's problem for JR, and then I think he's in. How's the rest of the team doing? Great. Kevin knows so many people. <laughs> that all he has to do is buy him coffee to get him to sign on. Well, I'm busting my ass torching Pantero's cars. Come on. You know you love it. I really do. This ain't your territory, dumbass! It is now. You fuck with Jim Rob, you answer to the Saints. Ah! Ah! Watch the 
Dane sure can dress well. The Saints have no history. You're about to get stumped! Jim Rob's garage is under the Saint's protection. Jim Rob's. Two for two, JR. Son of a gun, you still got it. Only thing left to hit is Derek's HQ. It's down on the corner. Oh, hell's bells. You gotta get back here. Derek and his crew just rolled up on me. This is what you get for fighting back, old man. You get off of my land. Fuck. Better hurry. I'm gonna say this one last time. Stay away from JR.
Bottle out! You're going down! That settles Derek and his crew. Right thoughtful of him to bring the fight to us. So, what should I tell my friends? Are you in? I'm in. What do you call this new outfit? We're the Saints. Welcome aboard. Well, we can count JR in. Uh, what is this? It's not board game night. No, this is where all our dreams come true. Don't say that. My dreams are pretty weird. While you were out talking to JR, I was going through the briefcase we got from John Bland, the real estate guy. Turns out the deeds of the church wasn't the only thing in there. As of now, we are the proud owners of a shit ton of empty lots all across town. That's real estate we can use to start up some new, um... Entrepreneurial ventures? By which he means crimes. Fine, yes, crimes. Nice. You did say we need to have our fingers in more pies. I've got that covered. I spent the whole day baking my ass off. Okay, fine. They're empanadas. That's not a pie. It's in the pie family. Now I'm really hungry. Plan first, eat later. Right, so, how do we cover all this ground? One building at a time. So far, we've got the church. And Jim Robs. So what do we build next? Whatever we want. Okay, look, there's nothing cool about toxic waste. It's gross, it's probably gonna kill you, but that green stuff's gonna make us rich. The big companies drive their toxic waste here and pay us big bucks by the barrel. Then we dump it on the cheap. Now, my man with the plan is Jersey Dan. He did time for this kind of shit, so he knows what he's talking about. He'll fill you in. Dan, where are the trucks? Well, turns out we gotta get the trucks ourselves. What? Why don't the customers bring them here? Our customers are respectable captains of industry. 
They don't want to be associated with the likes of us. Then fuck them. Now hear me out. For an additional transport fee, I arrange to have them leave the trucks at places around the city. All you gotta do is drive them here. Fine. I'll get the trucks. And that's how you lead by example. I put the first one on the map for you. 